After searching last night and then expanding that search this morning, crews are no longer looking for Richard Pratt. U.S. Coast Guard officials can't confirm, but they did say it's likely he fell overboard. Now, this all started last night around 615 when the Cape Elizabeth Fire Department found that sailboat run aground near Richmond Island. Multiple agencies joined the effort as boats, helicopters and planes search nonstop for the man. The Coast Guard tells us this is a trip Pratt takes off Often, and he's an experienced boater with a very detailed logbook. That's what helped officials narrow down the search path. The last recorded location was 930 Thursday morning and the last recorded time was 1215, but the recordings stopped there. They searched from Woods Island to Boone Island, but ultimately found no sign of Pratt. Search area. All that coupled with the fact that uh, you know, survivability in this water, it uh, is in the mid to high 60s at this point, um, isn't very long uh, for, for any person, regardless of your condition or swimming abilities that far offshore. And we will continue to keep you updated on this story, both on air and online at WMTW.com. But for now, reporting live in South Portland, Lauren Bradley, WMTW News 8.